क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोज फ्रॉम ई कीडा Hello friends in the previous topic we have discussed about the alpha amino acid and now in this topic i am going to talk about the classifications of the amino acids so what are those classifications let me talk about that in this topic so friends talking about the classification of alpha amino acids so amino acids are basically divided into two types that is it depends on the function and it depends upon the nature of the amino acid so talking about the function of the amino acid basically they are divided into two types that is one is essential amino acid and the one is non essential and talking about the nature of the amino acid so they are divided into three types again so that is we could say that is it could be a neutral amino acid it could be acidic amino acid or it could be basic amino acid so based on that let us understand what are essential and what are non essential amino acids so based on the functions of the amino acid they are divided into two types as we have discussed that is one is essential and one is non essential amino acid so what are essential amino acids that is the amino acids which are not synthesized by our body and are supplied through the diet those amino acids are basically called as essential amino acids for example if we talk about valine if we talk about that is lysine so these are the two examples that is what i have discussed about the essential amino acid and now let me talk about the next one that is non essential amino acid so these are those amino acids which are synthesized by our body and for example if we talk about the example that is glycine and alanine so these are the two amino acids which are synthesized by our body and that's the reason we don't have to get it from a particular diet so this was nothing but a classification of the amino acid based on the function and now let me talk about the classification of the amino acid based on the nature of the amino acid so here we are going to talk about the classification of the amino acid based on the nature so starting with the first one that is even they are divided into three types that is neutral amino acid so what are neutral amino acids the neutral amino acids are those amino acids where we can find the total number of carboxylic group and the total number of amino group they are found to be the same for example if we talk about glycine so in glycine there is only one nh2 group and there is only one cooh group that is the carboxylic group and that's the reason it is been called as the neutral amino acid so talking about the next one that is acidic amino acid so in that case if we talk about the definition of it or if we try to understand what are acidic amino acids so in that case basically the there will be more number of carboxylic group compared to that of the amino group so in that case aspartic acid is basically acidic amino acid so talking about the next one that is basic amino acid so in this case this are the amino acids which have more number of nh2 group compared to that of the carboxylic group and that's the reason that they are called as basic amino acid for example lysine so therefore this all is what i was discussing about the classification of the alpha amino acid based on their nature and based on their function that's it thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood this video very clearly and i hope i'll see you next time till then don't forget to subscribe to the channel thank you so much